what a fine morning it is once again in Dubai and I'm going to be starting off the day by casually jumping off a plane. Yes, that's right, I'm going to be skydiving. I've never skydived before. Don't really know how I'm feeling right now. It's something I've definitely wanted to tick off the bucket list for a while. And not only am I going to be doing it by myself, I'm going to be doing it with the one, the only, Larry Wheels. Mr. Larry Wheels. Right, on. <laughs> Good, on. Good bro. Good to see you, man. Pleasure, pleasure. <laughs> you ready for this? Of course. Did they, did they have to get you a special parachute or something? No, they just found a 50 kilo guy. <laughs> <laughs> really? Super experience, yeah. How much, how much do you weigh? How many kilograms? I'm about 130, but what? the combined weight of both of us can't be over 200. Yeah. So, I made the mark. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if it'll be the two most jacked people ever Probably. in the skydiving plane. <laughs> definitely one of the few. <laughs> the MVP of the day definitely goes out to a plane which is going to take us up there. Yeah. You're going to have to stand in the middle of the plane. So it doesn't go off on one side. <laughs> <laughs> How much? Uh -huh. 94.5. Steady weight. If you die, <laughs> if you die, you die. <laughs> Take a picture, send it to your dad to get him to look over it. <laughs> right now, Larry is enjoying some virtual muesli. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing, this is the best meat they've ever had. Is it? <laughs> it really is. <laughs> and Mike just asked them, how many calories do you eat a day? So. Uh, between 5 and 6k, depending on how big my prep for dinner is. So I have 4 meals I get for meal prep, and then I eat out twice a day for breakfast and dinner. If you were like a thousand calories under, what happens if you just notice the weight just comes up? For sure, it's very hard to maintain. I have a blazing fast metabolism, just like you do. And I'm sure you and I can relate where you miss a meal and you, like, you lose half a pound. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it just like costs falling off. You try and keep it like most of the time clean, or do you have junk food every now and then? Uh, I eat whatever I want for breakfast and dinner, but the four meals in between are pretty clean, yeah. Hi, Mom! <laughs> Can you just step inside this? Yeah, she don't do it. Oh God. You can call me Flavio. Flavio? Yeah, God is too much. Flavio. Flavio, the Brazilian, is going to be looking after me today. How many years have you been doing this? Two weeks. Yeah. Two weeks, yeah. Great, great. <laughs> this guy. 22 years. <laughs> 22 years. So what do you do, bro? Well, I don't know if you can tell, but I hit the gym every now. It's a little bit tight. <laughs> it's a little bit tight. So we're gonna be like that at the door, okay? I push us out. So I jump. And then as soon as you leave the plane, you put your hips forward, like together. Yeah, try to relax. It's not fight. Yeah, don't fight the wind, you know, let the wind mold your body. How are you feeling? Oh, do you know what? I think the less you think about it, the better. The more you start to think, like, why am I doing this? Is this safe? Who the hell is the guy that is in charge of my life? You know, you start to stress yourself out, so uh, I'm, I'm ready. I, I have a feeling I'm going to absolutely love this. I really do. Good smile. Oh, he's done this before. <laughs> the most nervous smile I've ever given. What up, Michael? How you doing? Good. I'm pumped. I'm ready. Slightly nervous as well at the same time. Going skydiving, yeah? Yeah, first, first, time, time. first time I've done this. All uh, right. Uh, we're going to put you in the plane, climb to 13,000 feet, onto the door of the Palm Jermaine Dubai and jump out. Any message to your friends and family? Uh, I love you all. Um, yeah, see you on the other side. All right then, buddy. So you understood all the instructions? Yeah. Any questions? No. Are you ready to skydive? Yes. All right, let's go and do it. Big smile, have fun, okay? Hey, Larry, how are you? Never better, I'm pumped. Yeah, you're pumped. Why? What happened? Well, I can see you actually are pumped a little bit over there. <laughs> <laughs> <It's a bit laughs> tight. What's happened today? Today I'm going to jump out of an airplane for the a first time. Perfect plane. Are you ready for it? I've been ready for a couple of weeks now. No, I'm that's, prepared. That's good. That's good. See ya.
How do you feel? Oh my god. That's just ridiculous. Best thing you've ever done. That's insane. You can't even describe it. It's just when you're climbing up, the anticipation and the nerves are just ridiculous that you can go higher and higher and higher. Oh, I can't even speak. My mouth is so dry. At one point my lips are like, they're going up like that. Your mouth breathes and nose, nose breathes. I was this mouth. But the worst thing is I wear contact lenses as well. Oh. So the wind was coming up and I was like, my left eye was like, I couldn't even see out of it. <laughs> Best thing you've ever done? For sure. Yeah, it's up there. Someday. Top three. Top sure. three. Yeah. What's the best? The best? I can't say. Uh, <laughs> I can't say. <laughs> so, kill <cute>, private. <laughs> so I'm going to share a few pictures with you guys at a skydive because these are too good just not to see. Obviously, this is where I was literally about to jump off the plane thinking what on earth is going on. Naughty bit of quad separation though, I'll take that. Obviously here, looking down to the ground, thinking about my imminent death. Next picture, I think this is the first time I spot the cameraman, so I'm, I'm trying to like pull out a bit of a smile. But you can see there is so much air going into my nostrils, it's like ripping my nose apart. I've never seen my nose look like that before. So with the amount of air going into my brain, it's very hard for me to smile. I think this is the only acceptable photo out of like 50. And this one, I have absolutely no idea what is going on here but that is amazing. Next time around, I'm not gonna need a parachute because I've got a spare one on my face. So, Larry, I'm very glad to have shared that rather stressful and distressing experience with you. It was a hell of a lot of fun. I'm not gonna lie, I thought if we were ever gonna do a collab, we would be in the gym and not doing this. <laughs> but that was that was so good, that was so fun. So hopefully next time we'll get a gym session in. Oh, 100%, man. And I'll try and hit some PRs.